And then I have to like try and like block all that out and just go back and think about like right. what I know. Alright guys, we are live and we're just waiting on Ryuzilla. I'm here. And then I had to think about that. I was like, I remember this. You. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm coming. Give me one sec. I was grabbing something out of my closet. Because me and Thundercross were trying to watch this last week when we were driving home. And it was like really spotty because the Twitch app for whatever. Carlton, I have one bit of advice for you. Hold on. Yeah. Believe in the heart of the cards. <laughs> it's Christ. time to do. <laughs> yeah, you generally have good reads. Yeah. Um, you really do, Carlton. That's why when I was talking about people I would save. Carlton's a strong save. Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah, we were so we were watching, like trying to watch as much as we could last week on the drive home, and I just remember like hearing one of the games. Like I, I remember, I think it was, was that your first week, Anxious? Last week. Uh, yeah. What? Last yeah, last week, week. First week and I just remember hearing like you making it through the end, and like hearing like good things about your play. And I said to like keep that in my mind towards the end. I was like, I haven't played with him all, like, but I think people said really good things about his play. So he is capable of doing this. Well, that's one. That's one of the reasons I I, I tried to get. Um... Ryan out pretty early because I knew that like I was trying to kill the people that like I had played with already because okay. they were the ones that were probably gonna be like most suspicious um, of me. Okay. Also, he's just a str he reads people pretty strong, I think. So no, he's a he's what? a good first kill. He's a really good first kill unless you think that there's a medic that's gonna save him. Yeah, I told you, Ryan. Ryan first night kills new meta. Jason, bro. Because we were Where's talking last week about changing the meta up, like a lot. Like, where's the kill, bro? <laughs> no man, because see, if everyone else like saving and then if the person is mafia, it's okay to lose. But to you, man, I, I can't lose to you again if you're mafia. They save you. <laughs> There's no, I think Ryan and Tim are both really hard to tell between town and mafia when it gets down to it. So, which there, I think there like, are other saves. If you're gonna lynch Tim, lynch him early so it doesn't get to that situation where he giggles at everything and you can never find out what's chop, going on. Chop. Dude. So oh, many no. chop jokes. Oh my god. Just, just oh my god. I wasn't <laughs> I might pull it earlier. I wasn't loud enough, I, I guess, about it, but I'm I'm really glad, Carlton, that you picked up and held true to the like I was sure that Tim was town and and yeah. I was kind of honest though about how like if Tim was mafia and they played it like that from the start, that he deserved to win his mafia. I can see how you'd think that, but like while it was happening, I was so sure that because Rob Robbie was just fishing for a lynch. He just wanted he, he was yeah. he was chopping at the bit. I like the thing is the reason show. I didn't call him out on it is because Robbie is really good at killing me as soon as I start calling him out. So I just wanted to stay in the game longer. So that's why I didn't call him out. Right. Yeah. But at that point I had no doubt. Yeah. No he, doubt. I mean he was he had the biggest smirk on his face right from the beginning. He was playing totally mafia. He had a very aggressive out the gate strategy. That's Robbie. That's how he plays. Like Yeah, that's yeah. Like regardless, I've never I think I played maybe one game with him. So is that how he is always or just when he's mafia, um, more so when he's mafia. Okay, gotcha. What are our ratios for this game? Uh, I think I was just gonna do three one one again. Uh, Miller or Vidge? Well. No, I was just gonna do three one one. Vidge is so big. Okay. I mean, do we want out of Vidge? No, Vidge is a big. We should add Batman. No, we should add anything. We should get some Miller. I like I like three one one though. That game was there, good. There, there are one. No, it was fine. Down, I was just asking if we were changing it up. Okay. We've got what two more now? Because yeah. I mean, it, even get like, even like with the copy getting two mafias, like two rounds in a row, even though the game wasn't hundred percent down safe. So I think we yeah we should just play it out. Okay, yeah, well I've I've stuff. already uh, made all the rolls for rolls, so if everyone wants to go to sleep, we can uh, do our stuff. What? I know. Or our cameras Sleep. are off. Yeah, cameras are off. Okay. And let's see. And cop. Okay, 
Roles have been assigned. Uh, Mafia, please kill someone or two people. Me medic, please save someone or try to. And cop, please check someone. Okay, morning comes around. Um, everybody except for Daniel and Jason come back. Jason with an eye. Mm. My brethren, <laughs> you'll be missed. I think that was punishment for not finishing the last game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So does that mean Tim is mafia? No. <laughs> um, too obvious, right? Too obvious. No, it's, it's, it's got to be unctuous again, right? Obviously. Sort of, obviously. <laughs> obviously. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty salty about what happened. So, Ryan, why are you Mafia this time? <laughs> yeah. Not I, bro. All right. It's another good meta kill. Who's I the good meta like, kill? Actually, the, I, I would say so the, the last game. always changing. No, I mean, the last game, I would say, was technically a bad meta kill because it actually made me really suspicious of, like, Unctious and Rob. No, I agree. I think Ryan's never a good first night kill. If you're mafia, yeah. well, Mang it's good. Ma Mango, what do you yeah. think of the kills? Oh, good kills. Not likely to be save targets. Other than that, I don't really have much to read. Yeah, these aren't re kills you can get read out, reads off of. Mango, are you in a different room than usual? No, my lights are off. Um, oh. After a power outage, I don't know. Some of the lights. <laughs> I heard my legs are off, and I was like, what are you talking about? <laughs> Me too. <laughs> All right, nobody, huh? All right, let's see. So Ryan's still alive. Yeah. What's going yeah. on, Rybo? It's your first game. You're being quiet Today. already. Yeah. Oh, yeah, What's Rybo. up? <laughs> nah, I just, uh, I'm just watching everybody's face, man. Did you sleep well last night? Sleep. Yeah, actually, I slept nine hours. Oh, wow. So it was like, like five hours, clearly then I wasn't, you kill, and then four more? Or? No, I slept right through my <laughs> room sleep. Right through it. Did you just like leave a note for your mafia brothers on who to kill? <laughs> no. Did they know you're having sleep trouble? And they're just like, you just take the night off. We we got you. No, I mean, I guess because I didn't kill anybody. Are you an accessory to murder? Am I what? An accessory to murder. <laughs> no, I didn't pull the Aaron Hernandez. Mm. How so you Carl, me? you're finally mafia this time, right? How you feeling, Rob? Me? Yeah. I have some reads. I'm just kind of letting things brood out before I say anything. How um, do you have reads is, already? You got reads already. Uh, oh, well, I mean, you want to know again? my read right off the bat? It's that religiously from the start until the point that Kimball came out last time, Carlton was making notes, but he's been holding the piece of paper up into like his mouth up until this point. So he's obviously not writing down notes if he has the paper up to his face with one hand. Well, there's no, yeah, no real tells that happened yet. What's happened yet? Well, I mean, right off the bat, you had to yeah. be suspicious, Besides, like, within the first five minutes. So. I mean, I can make a note. We all talked about Ryan being alive, and then we all <laughs> talked about Rybo being alive. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I did you know that at I, this point so soon was that it was going to initially be squashed, and now if there was anything suspicious. That, I mean, I did know, notice the new behavior, and that's why I that's why I like poked him, but I, there's nothing to go on. That, no, I'm not saying it's it would be. Like, yeah. It would have been more pro town to hold that back a little bit longer until it turned into something. Right. 
Well, I mean, you guys instantly got on me, and that'd be incredibly I, suspicious. So I kind of just, just back off. So I just, I just found out that um, we don't have a Miller or a Vich or anything. It's just yeah, copper. It's mm -hmm. okay, so, I mean, I'm going to ask the obvious. Uh, if a cop found um, a mafia, they should 100% come out. There's like absolutely no reason not to. So. Well, you saw what happened last <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, right, then. Well, I mean, I that was all because you guys fucking killed me. Chances. Hey, I did my role as a cop just fine. No, I think yeah, he, did he did what he cop. could do. You right. did exactly what you should have done. You, yeah. You found two guilty people, then you killed an innocent man. Hey, <laughs> I apologize before I killed you. Does that make you feel any better? I mean, I'm alive now, so it's okay. Dude, innocent people die in this game. It happens so all the time. This town that almost lost. You should know. You put most of them down. <laughs> no, dude, I was an innocent person <laughs> last game and I died. So I haven't you got played your with revenge, Nick, I haven't played with to, Nick uh... before. Is he somebody's friend or? He's my brother. If you couldn't tell by the facial hair resemblance, it's very, it's very similar. I yeah, can see it now. yeah, exactly. So Nick, no, but... what are your thoughts, Nick? What are your thoughts? Well, my thoughts. I would say, let me find his name, Carlton is definitely town because writing the notes, like if he was mafia, he wouldn't even have the card up to his face. Like I would have it down like at the table if I was writing notes and no one would see it. <sighs> and you're supposed to be my brother. Don't count my But mind. having it up at your feet <laughs> like, makes it show that he's showing to some effort in town moves. So I would think he was town. I think it's too uh, much of a meta. I think we... we I don't, think, I don't think you can say anything um, either way about that. That's I'm what I'm saying. I think I had thoughts are fishy yeah. at this point. You have to just move on. Yeah, yeah, I move. I move. We take the note taking off the table. I agree. Sitting. Let's never talk about it again because it was mentioned in the first two minutes. It was good reasoning, dog. But you're uh, like from previous experience, so you piggybacked on Rob. Always take notes, I, so that could I, be used against him. And it was used against him. <laughs> I, get, I think we're going to start talking in circles about a sub meta play that happened in the first 90 seconds yeah. of the game. Just so why are we still talking yeah. about this? I, I, I said, it. let's I, drop it. I think I think killing Daniel was a good mafia play, whoever, whatever mafia decided to do it, because uh, everybody wants to agree with that accent. So, <laughs> <laughs> so what happened last game? Always happened. happened. Too convincing. He <laughs> town around. So, <laughs> no, no, no. I'm, I'm so, like, I really don't I'm have a read on anyone. So hard right so, now. I'm actually getting a town read off of Tim, but that's just huh? the way that, like, his intense, like, you How know, you like the way that he's like, oh, you must be mafia then, Mango. Yeah. You just made a huge mistake. You you can't get a town read off of Tim. <laughs> and this is where Kimball comes Tim's, out as Tim is just always a rat. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't necessarily like, mean that it's a you know that he's a good town I and mean, he's probably a, like a bad. He might yeah, he might be one of those killer towns that they call mafia members. Um, <laughs> That's all I meant by town read. Mm. No, but if, if I had to vote, if I had to vote someone off right now, it would be unctuous. <laughs> I wanted to say until that last statement Unctious said he hasn't been saying much and then the other two games I when he was mafia he would call me out like so hard for not talking but you've been talking <laughs> this no is even no last game you were calling me out oh yeah because you weren't begin. talking you didn't talk like now you have been like this round no, you last have up game. This point. yeah because you weren't you talking. were saying that too yeah last game you weren't talking at all Noble. I was super sketchy on you Oh, like, okay. You're sketching me out. Like, right now, you've been talking, so I haven't said shit about you. You're not that right, suspicious right I now. I feel like... The... Ryan, I what are your um, I'm getting a pretty strong town read on Tim as well. Uh, I agree with you, Mango. Like, usually, he just has this gigantic smile right at the beginning, and his <laughs> smile is, like, medium at best right now. I think yeah, it's I mean, I've watched Tim quite a lot, like, over, you know, the last... You know, a couple times we played, but Ever since I've never born. seen him like so like focus on the game as Mafia. Yeah, um, it seems like he's really trying to be a good town for once. You know, so T Tim, how do these defenses of you make you feel? You feel good as a town. So Tim, and, uh, since you're so obviously town, who do you think is Mafia? Um, well, for one. Uh, I don't think that's a good precedent to set just because someone's obviously town that they have good reads on mafia. Because no, as I'm, intently, I'm just, I just want to hear you. I just want to hear you talk. I don't. Yeah, think I haven't. I don't want to talk right. over 
didn't want to talk over anyone. And like, I'm kind of doing the same thing as I did last game, like early, you know, uh, kind of a week first course to let everyone run their course. And then I guess if it, I don't want it to get in the same situation, so I'll talk. Um, it's really hard. Like I was looking intently and it's really hard because I was looking at Ryan. Like I always look at Ryan because if he is mafia, we are screwed. Like we are automatically like at a disadvantage if he's mafia. Um, but again, he's really hard to read. If I had to, just like if I had to vote someone, like it's just really hard to get a read on anyone right now. I feel, God, this is like this is like a five percent confidence level that I would vote anyone, and everyone else is like one percent right now. But like it would be, it would be Nick. No real reason, nothing personal. I'm just gonna go with Nick. Uh, you know, actually, you know, no, there's some reasons. Let's bump that confidence level up to twenty percent. Um, I just wasn't Whoa. really appreciative of the of the note taking comment, and like I said, that's why I said let's move to move it off the table. And he may not know, you know, or like you know, he might thought it was it was good, but I just disagree with those kind of moves. So I mean, he's, um, he's a newer player, so I yeah, mean, I'm, I'm getting a shitty gonna... a shitty town read off of Nick, and like I'm okay with <laughs> a shitty town. I would rather. Lynch a shitty town than uh, a good town. Uh, Nick and Rob, how do you guys feel about each other? You guys, I don't know so if you guys know each other well. Or... Well, he's my brother, so yeah, I know, I know him pretty well. I mean, we kind of know yeah. each other. Like, <laughs> I, li- I kind of live with him, so I know him a yeah. little bit. I can go. Do you want to do our defense together on his camera? I could just walk over in the other room. No, um, <laughs> no, I not online. I'm talking about like, like how do you guys feel each about other. each other right now? Like, yeah, your reads on each other. He always covers his face, so I don't see anything. Like, I can't really, like, get anything from him. If he's covering his face, like, I can't see his, like, if he has any mouth gestures or anything like that. Sorry to interject, but I 100% agree. Rob always fucking covers his face. Yeah. So, I can't really... I'm leaning leaning away from Nick as a mafia just because, like, those little, like, reads, whether they're right or wrong, I mean... I don't think a mafia would even be bringing those up. Storzerk. And yeah. why haven't you formed anyone yet? <laughs> <laughs> why, why haven't you come out as cops? What's, what's going on here? What's Wait, Bob, um, why, why haven't you fake claimed yet? <laughs> okay. Did you okay. check last night? Oh, come on, guys. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's like the boy uh, that kind of uh, uh, he's going to be I'll just, uh, I'll, I'll just go with what I've been seeing so far. I thought it was a little weird that Mango came off, I guess... He said he he felt the town vibe from uh from Tim, and I thought that was a little bit weird. Uh, let's see, I don't know. I just thought that was weird. MLG Ryan went with it well. I don't know. That's just my thought on that. I wanted. I've said Noble's name twice now. I wanted to hear more from him. Um, yeah, could you imagine if Ryan and Mango and Tim were mafia? <laughs> no, it wouldn't be all <laughs> fair. Yeah. No, like, no, but... Uh, that would be a horrible play. Yeah, it would be too obvious. I would be leaning to Lynch either Rob or Nick right now. You got a hate for that family, Why huh? Do you say that? No. What's your reads on, on them? Well, Nick, not so much now, but Rob, I really don't think he's that strong of a uh, player. I think he's a weaker player, and... In terms of you know what we have, yeah, it's a shot fired. Whatever. Um, I, I, kind of, I think I, it's I think he's a fine Lynch for first day right now. So I don't agree with uh, Storzerg's choices, but I don't think I'm getting a town read off him. I don't think he's mafia. Um, the people that I would vote off right now are Noble, Unctious, and I guess those two are my main ones for now. Noble. Uh, well, hold on. Before we move on, I want Noble. I want to hear more from Noble. I want to. Yeah, I want to say this. I think we should push Noble more, not because you know he's. Tim, he's you're not quiet. Noble. Shut up. No, I, I just want to say he, he. It seems like he's muting his mic because he has issues. So I think that might be a reason he's not talking a lot. Well, no, it's fine. We're calling on him right now. So yeah, exactly. So no, I just. All right. right there. So, what I can see from right now, like last game, I thought like. How Tim played, like he could have played as a mafia, but with the with how the mafia were playing before, like it was pretty obvious that it was unctuous. I kind of have an idea that 
unctions is clean this game because he seemed more in he seemed more talkative in the other games that he was mafia and i just feel this is something that's different for him so maybe he just trying to observe and see what everyone else is saying as for um Storzerk said nick or rob i feel rob is stronger player than Storzerk says and if i was picking between uh people here i would say either nick or umchis um other than that ryan's just always you know he just seems like he's always observing stuff mango's interjecting like he usually does um i feel looks like ribo's been a little quieter as well so i mean that's what i got for right now but all right so i i really the more that um I really didn't like that defense, essentially. Um, I really think it's noble. No, it's not. I call. actually like this defense. Yeah, that's a heavy call. Like, he, he, he spoke very genuinely. I really did not like it. I really no, did not like it. I, I am really, really suspicious. That. I'm really suspicious of Mingo right now. Because, see, I've how, kept quiet when I've been accused really hard. Like, the other times when I was uh, town, like, Unctious accused me really hard. And I didn't, I didn't look, I look back on that and I like should have questioned why he's questioning me so hard. So you're doing something similar to that. So that's why, you know, I'm going to question you too. So. Wait, I, one thing I want to point out. Though, like my name keeps coming up in this, but I want to, I want to point something out. Um, as I said before, the reason I always called Noble out was because he was always quiet before and he actually spoke up pretty early on this game. So I was keeping an eye on him. And similarly, the people that I'm kind of t keeping tabs on right now, Ribo has been more quiet than, than I would have expected him to be. Um, I think that's a little bit suspicious and I think that's worth talking about. Carlton just seems like he's kind of observing at this point. And I am surprised that Jason Kimball isn't talking as much as he did last game first round. Anxious, what do you think about uh, me? I think, I don't know what you're doing right now. I don't have a fair read on you because the way you just jumped all the fuck over Noble was a little bit suspicious because to me, I think he's, he seemed pretty genuine. Um, so I, I think agree that's with you on I, that as well. Mango seems a little bit shady this game. But at the same time, I will say, I, I, I think you enough to say that I, I'm not familiar enough with your normal play style because I've only played what one, one or two games with you. So it's, it's not like it's anything huge. But for anybody, that was suspicious play. I, I, feel I like will just say I think that Mango would probably be a good enough player not to if he was Mafia to not just like sh give it like do something that obvious, but it was a little weird. Uh, I'm not quite ready to declare him Mafia because of that though. Yeah, it was a little weird. I, think, I, I, I feel I feel like if, if he was Mafia, he would have been more he would have been more careful than that. If if like, anyone has like, played uh, Mafia with me in real life, I think only Shindigs here has actually. So it's not as oh and stores are sorry. But Fuck, man. I, I make those kind of reads all the time. Like, I don't really give any, like, backing set. I mean, I don't give any, like, strong evidence saying, you know, they misspoke or something. But, you know, I just base it off my previous experiences of, you know, playing with the guy, you know, looking at their reads, how they're speaking and stuff. It's very minor stuff that I pick up, and I tend to go with my gut. So, Guys, I'm, I'm really, really sorry. Much. I'm really sorry. I have to step out for two minutes. I have to pick something up for my old roommate. I'll be back, like, Dude, two you minutes. Do Right. Okay. So, I, I will say that I have seen Mango make those kind of claims like early on, especially in a, a round one. But to me, like Noble's defense kind of just felt like typical Noble. I mean, I didn't get a, really a mafia or a town read off of it either way. I didn't get a strong reading. I didn't. Uh, hold on. Uh, can you talk more about Tim? Why? Why you felt he was pretty clean? So to me. Yeah, you. Because you, 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 you said he felt pretty clean very early into the game. So I, I'm usually a big, like, gut slash reaction type. Like, I just look at people, and then I get the feeling from my brain or my gut or wherever it comes from. And uh, Tim, like, usually he has this look on his face. It's usually a gigantic smile or something that he can't contain. And um, it just doesn't really feel like he's got the mafia smile this game. So that's pretty much. I, I called him out really hard in that play style though last game. So it could be he could be just trying to like really watch his play. Well, like regardless of what side of the spectrum he's on, whether he's Santa Mafia, he could just be really watching his play. Okay, and then back to Tim. Okay, so I'd like to say that, I mean, like I said, the first game, 
you saw me move in and out of the camera, like being really wacky. Like I said, I just got back. Like I was like rushing back. I'm not in my typical apartment. I'm at a friend's place and they're putting, they actually are like putting up with my yelling. I feel so bad. Um, and like, you know, I'm all over the place. I'm back from a job that I'm not familiar with. I'm back in an apartment I'm not familiar with. I'm, it's LA traffic. I'm really sweaty. I just want to settle down. Now I'm focused. I want to get in the game. This, this is actually a pretty hard game right now because I'm not getting strong well, reads off anyone. So that's, I, I want um, you to talk about, in particular, MLG, Ryan, Mango, and Noble. Mm -hmm. That kind of, like this kind of triangle that's going on right now, and you as well. Like you're connected uh, I mean, to that. I mean, I don't know, because like the moment they kind of say that I'm clean, I'm like absolutely relieved, right? Like I keep saying I respect Mango and Ryan reads, um, and the town respects them too. So when they say your town, I just kind of breathe a sigh of, a sigh of relief, and I don't really think about you know, the rest of it. Yeah, but like the but like the thing that sticks out is you didn't do anything. Like you didn't say anything in particular that really stood out as oh yeah, like like he's just saying like you weren't smiling is essentially what he was saying. Yeah, so, I, like, were, I understand. Oh. So I'll I'll jump in here because it wasn't just that he wasn't smiling. Um, just like he had like this really intense gaze that he was really focusing on the game, watching everyone speak, trying to get reads. Which I I mean, as a mafia, you could fake that as well, right? But that's not normal behavior for Tim. Well, that's what he said he did last game, right? He said that he, when he's mafia, he's much more attentive. That's what I thought, and I think that's what he's not more attentive though. when he's I mafia. think we should just, you know, for now, move either kind of like punish Shindigs from the way, uh, the way he was playing last time or just move on from it. I think he's, I, I don't, I like the way he's playing now more, even if he is mafia this time and he was town last time. He played last yeah, that game. Was a, that no, was no, a I'm just saying that, like, the say. whole notion, I think we, we're kind of circling around his behavior, the way he played last game compared to this game, and I think that we <laughs> no, should... No, I mean, I barely even watched last game, so my my reads aren't even based off that. Yeah, you were sending just... chopped messages, PMs, to him. No, it was Mango. That's what, that's what I, I watched, like, the, last, always, that was watched the, the last 15 minutes of the game, so the last no, like, two I, And rounds. honestly, I didn't even watch. I was killed night one, and then I didn't even really watch the game. Like, yeah. so I, my reads aren't from last game either. I just think a lot of attention was being spent on Shindig's and the way he's kind of like his behavior and like micro analyzing his behavior and comparing it to. I mean, I mean, his behavior is like he just always seems to put outside factors into effect. Like he'll say, "Oh, I'm like this because of this," or "I'm acting like this way because of that." Like he said that last game, and he's just saying that this game again. I just think for a while that you know. Hold on, Raibu. Yeah, Raibu. I have a question for Ryan. I have a question for Ryan. Um, what are your thoughts on Carlton? Carlton for me is one of my very toughest reads. Um, I haven't played with him. Like he's been off and on some weeks, some weeks he plays, some weeks he doesn't like he's very chill, very like matter of fact in his speech. And I feel like his mafia and his town game feel, feel kind of the same to me. Um, for him, I have to wait and see kind of what moves he does to suss out if he's mafia or town. He's been very. He's, I think he's been very precise about what he says. I think I'm I'm, I'm jumping in because I wanted to call out Carl, but then he spoke immediately when I was going to call him out, so I didn't. But I, the reason I have my eyes on Carl personally is because uh, Carlton, excuse me, I'm sorry. Thank you. Um, <laughs> uh, just because of the fact that he was like. He's very, very precise with his words, and he's very, being very careful. And I don't know if that's because he's walking on eggshells because he's town and he doesn't want to like go, go, jump to any conclusions, um, or if that's just because he's he's trying to watch his words so he doesn't incriminate himself. I have something to point out. I have something to point out. And I, Ryan has spoken twice. And I'm not saying he's mafia, but both times he's spoken, he's uh, directed his conversation towards Rob, and Cameron jumped on Ryan's back twice. What? Immediately. Making, did anybody like, else? Did anybody, uh, I just thought he made a couple of points. I mean, I've been, I've been agreeing else, with some other people too. I, I, just I mean, I get it, but I'm just saying times. that Ryan's spoken twice and immediately you're like, yeah, why? And it's well, it's just suspicious okay. Let me, to me. Let me let me address that. Let me address Ryan, that. I'm, I'm not accusing you right now. I'm just I'm just pointing out something to the rest of the people and seeing if anybody sorry, else is caught I, on. I gotta make a quick non-game announcement. I'm gonna be like moving my camera around a lot because I'm moving, but. I'll be back. I'm so sorry. I'll be back in like one minute. I'm really sorry to interrupt and do this. Right? You could just, just do it. Just off your camera. Okay. Yeah. So my camera will be off. Okay. So right. to to agree with Rybo, I mean, it is. I did seem like Ryan was agreeing with Mango uh, early on. That was the only thing that I picked up on. That there was there seemed to be a small 
agreement, allegiance, whatever you want to call it, between Ryan and Mango. Well, I don't. I don't think it's so much of as an as an allegiance between them. I just felt it really odd that there was just such a. I don't know. It just felt really weird that two people came out and either. I I, I want. I'm thinking right now that either, maybe one of them is mafia, and you know, Mango comes out and says it, and, you know, if if Ryan's. You know, Mafia, he's, he's just kind of jumping on as well because he knows Mango's a strong player. And But, uh, but I mean, maybe it's, it's very like, possible, but, I mean, from my point of view, like, it was super obvious to me that Shindigs was acting more like Town than Mafia. So, and you guys, I think someone mentioned that Shindigs looked suspicious for some reason. So I came out and kind of defended him. But mm-hmm. I, I wouldn't um, read too much into that. I really wouldn't. I yeah, mean, but, okay. but so, I, I wanna I wanna start talking about the quiet people. Like uh, Cameron is really quiet, Nick is still quiet, and Carlton has been quiet. So those three. I mean, I wanna. I mean, just to piggyback on Mingo, I really want to hear why Cameron jumped on Ryan's back a couple times. I mean, do you completely agree with him that Rob is one hundred percent mafia slash quiet? No, I, no, not at I all. I didn't say I mean, Rob is one hundred percent mafia. This like. You're putting words in my mouth. I, well, you I, know what I mean. Like you are suspicious of let, Rob. Sorry, I apologize. I don't. I mean, R- Ryan made a good observation. I was gonna follow it up with something I I had also said because I thought it was a good like thing to point out because I didn't think the uh, conversation was going in a particularly like constructive direction at that time, and uh, because we basically have spent two games now obsessing over Shindig behavior, so. Uh, Wait, but going, that's what I was saying. Was that we either need to just no, yeah, but the way you don't like no, no, stop. The way, the way, (laughs) (laughs) the way, the way you uh, went about saying it just was really odd to me, and I wanted to make sure that that didn't get overlooked because it, like, the the way you said, like, we should punish him for the way he played last game, like, that was just really weird to me. So I agreed with Ryan that it was weird. We're we're, we're crucifying him because of his uh, of the way he plays the game. We're not. I don't think that's what was going on. I mean, like, I think that's why he gets so much attention put on. No. Okay. Okay. No. The reason the reason that I give Tim attention is because Tim is one of my easiest reads, and that's that's it. Like, it has nothing to do with like punishing him or any. Like, I feel like I can just read Tim well. I also feel like I can read Rob really well. I've known Rob for longer than I've known anybody here. So wait, like oh, wait, hold on, your your thing on Rob? How are you feeling on him? The only thing I've said about Rob is that when he said let's punish Tim for or he said should we just punish Tim for how he played last game or move on, I said, what are you talking like that's really weird. And so, that's all I've said. I haven't called him Mafia or Town. So yeah, but what do you feel about what I've done for the past three even when I was Mafia, what I've been doing for the past couple of days games is that I feel like we often kind of focus in on one thing specifically or one player and we spend so much time revolving discussion around that one player that we stretch out these first like two days into obscenely long lengths and I think I that you, we, either, we could do better by either just dropping the topic temporarily and just moving on to other things and exploring other options or just doing a lynch and just moving on with it you know like kind of like make a decision on one way or the other because this state of limbo in between decisions I mean, is but really... But I don't think we should make I hasty understand. lynches. No, yeah, no, I understand no. as well, uh, but I'm you got to be really should... careful. This is I'm, a, I'm phrasing no it like that. Why are we even I mean, talking I mean, about this? Like are we actually going I, to be I don't lynching know. someone? I, I mean, I mean let's, right. let's just get the quieter people to talk first, and then let's yeah. get... like let's get back to Mango's point. Let's hear from Nick and Carlton, and then let's move on. You you and me. I'll go first. So just like things that I've noticed so far is I didn't think that it was mafia-ish of Mango to go after Noble so hard, but it did seem kind of more trigger happy than normal. Like when Mango's town, he gets really good reads, but I've never seen him like, like, and he wasn't, he wasn't formaling him, but it seemed like he really wanted like to go to a vote. Like it just seemed like that to me. And that seemed kind of trigger happy, at least for Mango. Well, and then, it, wait, yeah. wait, you know, I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> And then, like, the read on Tim didn't make sense to me because and because last game, Tim specifically said that when he's Mafia, he tries to pay closer attention to the game. And when he's Town, he pays less attention. And this game, he's been paying more attention. And Mango said that he felt Tim was Town because he was paying more attention. So that didn't really make sense to me. And then Ryan kind of jumped on and said, oh, I'm also getting the same read off Tim. So like, yeah, I just well, didn't really quite understand why. And I'm not saying it's wrong, but just, like, to me, it... 
it was kind of backwards. And I haven't really gotten to read on Tim one way or the other because I feel like he probably is changing up his play style this game. But well, I mean, oh, like, like, like me and Ryan and, and I have said about Shindigs, like we're not basing off last game at all, so you shouldn't even factor right. that in. So I'm just yeah. no, but I'm basing it off of what he, what he said his play style is and what I agree with his play style is. Not but not based off last game, but I'm saying what he said last game, not how he played last game, but what he said last game. Mm -hmm. And he specifically said when he's mafia, he plays more attentive because he wants to make sure that he's not getting called out. He tries to do that, yeah. That's right. what he said. Like he did um, say that. But now he's uh, AFK, dude. Right now, yeah, now he's AFK. Right, but but he wasn't AFK when he said that and when you said that you had a read on him. He wasn't AFK then. Car Carlton, Carlton. When 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 Mego made made his point on Noble where he felt like that was a bad defense, it it felt wrong, right? Like it felt weird, right? So I mean, let me let me defend myself. No, 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 no. I, I want Car okay. I want Carlton's answer. All right. I, I I no, I haven't read Noble was Mafia yet. Yeah, but, I had, I, but, the defense itself didn't convince me that he was. Yeah, but you felt it was kind of odd that Mango kind of jumped on it though, right? I mean, obviously Mango was already pretty set against him, so whether. So his the outcome of the defense doesn't change going into it. He was already going into it. No, I I think you might be remembering something wrong because I never like pointed Noble out as mafia until he made his defense. Like his defense was kind of all over the place. Like he it was almost as if like he was speaking for the sake of speaking, so that you know he won't be pegged as a quiet guy. Uh, on the uh, other hand, like, well, why did he give a defense if you were, if nobody was going after him? I thought he went after him and he made a defense. Like maybe I called out his name because he was quiet. Which is legitimate. I mean, I don't see. It was so early, though. But no, I was you specifically for, said I, my name, so you I, 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 I also specifically yeah. said I wanted to hear from Noble. Like I said, you know, Noble's name twice, and then you know, got overshadowed and brought it up, and then I guess Mango yeah. joined in as well, and then he made his comment after Noble was talking and said yeah. he felt it was. So like Mango didn't call on Noble. I called on Noble, and Mango made his, I guess, opinion. He he formed his opinion. Then, I mean, that's not how I remember it going down. But if that's what you're both saying, then I mean, Noble, I asked you to talk. I mean, right? I, I, I spoke more in the idea because Mango was calling me out. I did hear you say my name like twice when like a lot of other people were talking, but then, mm -hmm. um, then after I was done, then Mango was still on me, saying that I should be lynched, and I just said what I said already. Like you guys remember what I said, so that's it. I also so think. think Okay, um, go ahead. Um, I also think that maybe Mango is going on to Noble because Noble does, or at least in previous games, especially his first couple of weeks, he would get lynched early and easily because his defense would be very lackluster in terms just saying, hey, it's day one. You can't really talk about day one. There's really not anything going on. And I don't know. It just it seemed like it was almost forced. Like that's that like that's my uncomfortableness with Mango right now. It felt forced. I mean, cause right okay, I'll be honest. Right now, I have a pretty large circle of people that I think are town. So any kind of suspicion on the remaining people, I'm going to jump on just because first rounds last so long. They drag on, right? Mm -hmm. And I'd rather just go on someone out of the remaining people that I think are safe. You know. So. What a, okay. <laughs> All right, Tim. So, what do you think? Sorry, <laughs> <laughs> what are you like? No, hold on. You'll see what I'm doing. But I just don't want my brother to get away with murder because he was he was supposed to talk after Carlton. He never did. Well, yeah, sorry. Wait, okay, let's hear from Nick. Yeah. All right. So, you just want me to go down the line who I think is mafia and who's town, or sure, you can do All that. Right. So, we'll start with Robbie. I thought what he was trying to do with trying to get like the lynch on Tim I think it was or just because with his play I understand what he's trying to do and I don't think it was a bad move I understand he wants to just get this moving so I don't think what he did was bad uh Noble seemed like I I don't understand what he was doing but it seemed fine it was just like his just gut feelings I guess and uh I want to go to Storzerg now who I think is mafia because he seems very fidgety I don't know if that's just him in general because it's my first time playing with him I don't really know him but I've seen him moving around, putting his hand on his face, and always leaning back like this, and just moving a lot. I don't know if that's yep. out of the ordinary or anything. But that's what I've been noticing. Okay. What about what, what people have been saying, though, besides just body language reads? 
Well, I haven't really, I haven't paid attention that much right now. <laughs> you haven't paying attention? I've been rough. I have to be completely rough, honest. Man. Like, I, I'm that's, getting that's a really content. shitty, shitty read from Nick. Like, like a shitty town. Like, yeah, like he like he doesn't really know what he's doing, and he's like hasn't played this game very much. I feel like all yeah. anyone's getting is shitty town reads. Like everybody keeps saying, everyone like, shitty town. Like some people, some <laughs> I'm getting good town reads from some people, but I'm also getting shitty town reads. From Does some anybody people. have a mafia read? I'm I'm uh, well not a not. I a, mean, I have a like a, a wood I, 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 or, I like, mean, I can go to formal if you want. <laughs> I, I'm telling I mean, you, like, right now, like, I'm scared. It, it, I mean, really suspicious of mango, one. and I'm really suspicious I'm, of pop. Let's start formally, people. I'm, I'm really that. even if it's on me, I'll defend myself. Okay, yeah, can I, mean, I talk for a second? Because I've been quiet for a while. Okay. Let the doctor speak. So, I have a really good town read on store zerg actually, and yep. that may be different than a lot of people. And a lot of store zerg's accusations have been met with resistance, but I feel that his read on Rob is pretty good. I thought Rob did a really shitty, not pro town, um, right in the beginning about Carlton taking notes. So he had, he had a tell he was working on analyzing on Carlton. And as soon as we put any pressure on him, any accusation, he came out and he was like, Oh, well, I've got this read, but I shouldn't say anything. And three seconds later, he's like, okay, well, this is my read, which makes, regardless of the quality of the read, it makes me feel like he was feeling guilty and needed to defend himself very strong. It's perfectly fine to say, well, I've got some things going on, but it's still early. That's, that's fine. That's fine to say. Didn't he also say he had lots of reads? I mean, not lots of reads, but it definitely implied that he it was a, more he than had, one person. He's like, yeah, I had a couple, some things going on. Yeah. And then, and then we're like, okay, well. And it was know, just Carlton. And I, then how, yeah. I said, how can you have something so early? Right. And he's like, oh, well, I've got this thing on Carlton, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So that, that's had me tipped off for a while. Um, I thought that, I agree with you as well, uh, Storzerg, that Mango's reaction to Noble wasn't something that I saw. Mango's pretty perceptive. That doesn't, that doesn't necessarily mean that Mango's mafia, but I didn't feel it. I didn't feel it. Can I? You can didn't I, feel it. So. Can I say something? Because I feel like I get cut off every single time. I've tried to speak like 10 times and I just let it go. But sure. I'm, I want to bring up. Um, Wait, first, whoa, whoa. I'm just kidding. Sorry. <laughs> I swear to God, I was going to murder somebody. <laughs> Um, I wanted to say, I wanted to echo um, what what the doc is saying about Rob. I think Rob's, I mean, I think for everybody. Honestly, I think a red flag was thrown up for everybody uh, for Rob early on. Whether or not you, you that was something that um, you kind of think came to fruition later on is, is up to you. I think, I, I think out of everybody here, I think the strongest mafia read is Rob. That being said, Rob was being quiet again because no one's talking to him and it bothers me. Um, in like a weird uncomfortable sort of way that Storzerg is talking a lot. Like Storzerg seems super, super, super genuine, which is what's kind of getting it. Like it's, there's this weird like cognitive dissonance where he's talking a lot and, and really kind of controlling the conversation more than I'm ever comfortable any player doing. Um, but it also sounds decent. So it's, it's like mafia action of controlling, but like towny. Um, but you, what are you saying you kind of are agreeing with, right? Uh, I'm, uh, on Rob specifically, but I mean, so, he's put pressure on quite a few people. What, what about I, I want to say are, something. So okay. I actually initially thought Anxious was Mafia, but his statement right now um, seems pretty town. And I actually agree with Storzerg on Rob, and I also agree with Anxious on Rybo. Um, those actually, two would be my two votes right now. I've actually okay. already pointed out a pretty pro town move when I was trying to catch Cameron agreeing with Ryan constantly. So, I mean, I'm sitting here observing people. I, Being quiet is one thing, but I'm – constantly reading did, did anyone agree with your read on cameron anyone else i i don't know i'm not asking you i'm asking did anyone I mean, else can I, anyone i, else I didn't, I didn't feel about? anything right there i wasn't noticing that i wasn't watching for that though I'm just Rybo, Rybo Rybo out, is right in the fact that like i said something about rob and then uh cameron he was about a half second behind he was about to say the same thing i think even if i didn't say anything cameron would have said the same thing because we both picked up on yeah. rob saying something weird he just did it again. <laughs> <laughs> what okay, Cameron right. said, like, yeah, right yeah. at the end. Yeah. Well, no. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put a normal uh, on Rob. I gotta yeah, so I, mean, I was actually getting to the fence. I felt it was going in that direction. So sorry. I've been playing this town or mafia regardless, because I've been back-to-back -back mafia, but, but before that, I was always town cop medic. I've always had the perspective of that. I, I believe that things should be fleshed out day one and we should get a base knowledge of what everyone's standing. But I feel like out of the hour, 
long day ones that usually happen, uh, a lot of it's on dead air, on nothing important. And it's kind of going around the same point over and over again. And that's kind of the way I've just been handling day one, day twos for a while now. And that's what I meant by, you know, should we punish Shindigs? Because there's obviously some scrutiny on him because of the way he's been playing. That was the context there enough punishing. Uh, going on further from that, I think there's a lot of these, like, theories where, like, you just put, like, a bunch of pin, like, a point from the map, you're, like, tying string to, like, create a theory. I'm not tied into any of those theories. So I think if there's, like, these multiple theories that Bob was talking about between... Sorry, I was talking about between uh, Cameron and uh, Ryan. And then there was another one talking about Mango and going in, tying in with uh, Ryan as well, with Shindigs kind of looped in there as well. So you have like a re recurring pattern of certain players being brought into theories of cooperation and kind of guiding discussion. I think that maybe that the way I would be seen is definitely not conducive to helping the town, but I'm not kind of in any more elaborate, in-depth discussion of who is Mafia and who is not Mafia, you know, with these kind of coordinated stuff. So I think that if you want to kind of move more ground with a lynch overnight and see what happens next, I think it's a lot better to try and nip one of those theories in the bud day one before we have a lot of, you know, bodies drop between the lynch and possibly two kills. I think that is a more efficient time of town resources. And I kind I of let everyone talk then. and talk because uh, I know there's no sense in defending every single point along the way. I just, I just drop it all out right now. If you so want to go, if you want to move forward with one of the theories, then you got to pick someone then. Right. Well, Tell us what I think, you think. Right. But under the scrutiny of a lot of people having their thoughts on me being mafia, I think my words are taken with a lot less, you know, consideration. And I think it's better for. I understand there isn't anything conclusive on me, but I think it's important to let other people naturally flow out discussion, especially with Mango and Ryan still being alive. It's very weird for a day one with both of them still being alive to have as little input as they've had. I think Mango's done a little bit more than Ryan, but I just kind of was letting people naturally I mean, flesh out and see, because if I, again, if, if I were to come out I'm right really now, suspicious of you right now because you're not answering my question. Well, and my question is for you to give us a reason, or not a reason, just tell us who you want to be lynching other than yourself on the theories. I, you said, I just hey, let's go with the theory. Several names talking about these different theories and different Oh, no, you these haven't said before. anything. Well, you've one said, individual? I mean, you, well, you I mean, said I, Mango, like, you, you haven't... Is this my defense, or is this, like, a, a one, is this like a two-person show, or does anyone else want to kind of jump into? Because I think Stores oh, wait, a lot of the conversation. No, no, he's just trying to ask fire. you... Who do you? No. Who would you think is mafia, and who would you maybe want to? I mean, lynch? conjecture, right? So That's I was talking about the triangle. Asking. You know, he's asking for a name, and I feel like you're just dancing around bush bushes. No, like but you, you you went around the bush the for like a couple of my minutes. Response was that it was clusters of people that were suspicious. If you want me to say one, Cameron. If you want, in, in time with that, Ryan. You know, one of those two. I still had a strong consideration of Carlton from earlier. Those are my three names right now. If I were to go, just pick one randomly. Uh, I don't like doing that, but if I had to pick one, it would probably be uh, Carlton, just because of my read from the start of the game. But <laughs> okay. that was what you were and Carlton's face. And what great. do you think of Mango? What do you think of Mango? Mango? I think Mango's Mango. It's day one. There's not enough information. No, and no, I think... no. I want an. I want what you think. If you had to, if you had to say either town or mafia right now, what would you say? Uh, mafia. I mean, like these these are silly questions because you expect me to have a snap decision on all the players in the game right now when it's day one. It seems like a losing strategy to continually throw like yes no questions at me. And given the way that I play, I kind of think things out. Well, I have to be more direct because you aren't giving direct can, answers. Can I just can I just say something real quick? Yeah. Say something in, after in Rob's that. defense, in in Rob's defense, he's a good player, and I don't think that we should just pick him as a random lynch on day one. That being said, he hasn't convinced me that he's not Mafia. Oh, that wasn't oh. my defense? <laughs> that was I want to hear no, 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 like, I, don't think, I don't think that we should lynch. I don't think we should pick you as a random right. kill. That, that you're a good target for a random kill. Right. If you like don't I think said, that you're Mafia. So that's right. your defense. And then while I still have the microphone for three seconds, you haven't convinced me you're not Mafia. Okay, so you know, I just want to get an idea of, are you pushing this to a vote, or can we talk a little bit more about this? So, uh, I mean, someone else this has, has been like a five-minute So, my, my opinion is that 
at the same time, while he's not convinced me that he's not mafia, I don't think anything he said has screamed like "let's vote him right now." Um, I agree. So, if possible, I'd well, rather no, no. vote on someone else. Hold on, Tim. I think Tim? Something to see. Yeah, Tim's back. I actually okay. So it looks like I'm looking up all the times because I'm actually looking up at a TV. It's awesome. Um, <laughs> I'm going to fix that. So what I wanted to point out was I was actually kind of have a similar opinion as Rob in the sense that, okay, this is obviously a really hard day one and we should find a framework in which we lynch someone. But I was following him up to the point where he said, okay, but Mango and Ryan are still alive. Why aren't we talking about, or, you know, something along the lines where he referred to them being still alive. And, you know, that doesn't push me that he's mafia, but that's just bad. Like I, I trust Rob to be good enough to not defer to why is anyone still alive? Like, it's a, it's because the mafia didn't kill them. No, it the wasn't that I mean, it's, it's pretty it, simple why they're both it alive. It wasn't that, what, that they were still alive being right. suspicious. It's just that they typically have more control of the direction of the conversation. Well, and I think Schwarzenegger is at like 80% of the conversation control. At and, least in the uh, games I've played, uh, Ryan at least doesn't co really come online and still the second night. He doesn't really take control of the game like the first day. So, and that's what I've heard other people describe his play as as well. So it, it I mean, Mango definitely is somebody who you expect to really push hard. Yeah. The first but, night. I mean, there but, have been games where, you know, if other people are taking control, I let them take control and just watch, you know, there's yeah, no I, reason I mean, for me accusing, to take control yeah. every game. I'm so not I'm accusing you right now. Right. I'm just, and I'm just, I think Storzer has done a good job actually. Yeah. yeah I'm, I'm just, I'm just kind right. of, I'm just kind of digesting Rob's defense and I don't, uh, I, mean, I mean, I want to. I want to call. Are you rescinding? Can I? By the can way, I talk real quick? Can I talk real quick about yeah, Rob? Um, yeah. So, I'm I'm much more of a body language, like gut feeling type person, um, usually mm -hmm. than what people say sometimes, because usually people aren't going to fuck up in what they say. What I noticed when Rob was giving his defense is that a lot of times when he's playing town and he's defending, he's sitting back. And he's he's got his hand like somewhere near his mouth or like up here. And for most people, that's weird. But when Rob was giving his defense, he was sitting forward and his hands were like down, like not even on camera. They've come back. You this know, was in now, my defense. During during your defense. <laughs> oh, during my defense. Okay. Yeah, during your defense, you were you were much more forward than you usually are. You were much. I don't know. I'm gonna follow my philosophy to the grave. You guys are putting so much attention on me. Just lynch me for now, so we. We either start, either you guys kill me and lynch me, punish me for my actions, or we just move on to something move something forward with the conversation. I told, already said that with my lynch, I understand why you'd want to lynch me. I just think that for a day one lynch, there's better moves for all of these sub theories that everyone's been crafting and spouting about that will actually move something forward. As far as I'm concerned, I haven't really been tied to any sort of these like theories of people cooperating with each other. So if you want me to squash one of those theories kill one of those people now to ultimately put a rest to the you know it or you just I, kill me because subsequent the only collaboration on me theory, anyway the only collaboration theory that you've really been pushing is the idea that like i'm constantly agreeing with ryan which was which that was nobody the only one that there was also actually, one that was really talking that. about mango and ryan yeah that's actually not, I, was, I said that I, said. I wasn't saying that was the only one there was the other one with mango and ryan but that's what it so is. Stores I mean, are, every, everybody stores are, are you going to go forward with the vote or are you going to reset? Before vote now. Yeah. Yeah, it's time. Are you guys voting? I want to say... Okay, I was about to say, I'm not voting Rob, and I actually do like his defense, and I do not think that he's mafia. Well, it's currently. been just about if he is, 45 minutes, so let's try and hurry okay. around. I, I, don't okay. know, I don't know. Who's, I will put a formal on Mango now. I don't know who's a bad town and who's just a mafia member. It's like really frustrating. All right. So, is there anything to your formal that specifically I should defend against, or can I just give a general defense? Um, I, I guess I can start from the beginning. The first thing that got me a little suspicious was was the deaths, and you said they were very good kills. And the last time, or actually last two times I played with you, I asked about those, you know, first deaths when you were mafia, and you said they were good kills, and that's all you really said about it. But then. It went off to get me lynch day one. And this game, then I guess moving forward, this game, I felt it was really, I felt it was a little weird that you kind of dumped on Tim being clean pretty fast. And it also made me uneasy about Noble. And I'm a little uneasy as well because just of 
you've been there hasn't been any more resistance in anything I've said from you. You've kind of been agreeing. Yeah, because all right, so I'll give my defense. So yeah. my defense is that I like the way that you're playing, so and I think your town. So maybe it seems suspicious to you that I'm not trying to get you voted off. I don't know what you meant by that, but um going back to Tim, um I mean, it maybe makes me more suspicious because Ryan's agreeing with me, but like everything about the way that Tim was acting, the way that he was looking at the screen to his tone, to his facial expressions from my previous games, you know, not even counting the last game, it just screamed town to me. Obviously he could be acting, I could be wrong, but that's my read. Um, What was the other next person? Noble? Noble, yeah. All right, so first of all, I didn't even call the vote on Noble. I didn't, like, pressure him, really. Um, no, I, I asked only him made, to, yeah. I, I felt like I asked him to talk, and then you gave your yep. opinion afterwards, and you thought it, he was Mafia. Yeah, so I feel like I have a decent read on Noble. Um, you, I mean, more of a decent read when he's town, but this time when he was defending himself, it just seemed like – I mean, I said this before. It seemed like he was talking for the sake of talking. He was, like – going through a list of people, but he didn't really have anything conclusive to say. So that made me suspicious right away. Um, was there anything else that? I think I say you can move on to your general defense now. If okay, you want. so um, Ryan, I can never trust him 100%, but everything he's said so far, I agree with. So, you know, take that for what it's worth, but for now, I would definitely not vote him out because even as Mafia, sometimes you have to play in town's favor to get their trust, right? So it could be that kind of ploy that he's doing. But I think every everything he said are correct reads from my point of view. So I would definitely not vote him out. Um, obviously, you, you've been really aggressive, um, which I like. And I think someone else um, s- said it perfectly, like your like earnestness or, you know, um, really like makes me think your town. Tim, I already went over. Um, that's pretty much it for my town reads. Tim, you, and Ryan for now, but I can't trust you him. Said, uh, you said uh, you nicked us or whatever, and you said, well, you definitely okay, said. So you initially, I thought, initially, I thought he was Mafia just because he was really quiet, and I remember the first game he was Mafia. Yeah, he, but you said you, you got a town read from him. Yeah, yeah. So initially, if you remember this game, I I, I was saying I'm thinking I, I went, noble I was... and unctuous. Okay. But um when he was talking about Rob, I wanna say, or someone else, um, I don't know, it just seemed town to me. And I remember the first game he played he ever played with us, he was Mafia. Um, he interjected a lot more and tried to control the flow of the game, which he's not really doing. Uh, maybe he's changed his play style, I don't know. Rob, I'm still on the fence with. Um, I don't think I would vote for him, but he's definitely someone we have to watch out for. Um, Noble, I still feel that he's suspicious. He hasn't really said anything um, at all since you know we voted him. And but the person that I would vote off right now is definitely Ribo. It's just I don't know. He it's funny. Because I was just about to say that I I don't think Mango is a good lunch first night. <laughs> no. I- I've been quieter than I tend to be, and I want to. It is my duty to speak up and be part of the game. Um, well, right now the form is on Mango, so it should be. Right, about so me. I mean, that's pretty much my. <laughs> Never defense. mind. I will yeah. keep being yeah. quiet. Um, there are plenty of people <laughs> that are quiet that um, we could just lynch for the sake of them being quiet, and I would be okay with that as well. But if, if I had to make the call, right, it would be on Ribo, but. Based on based off nothing concrete, just the way that he's been interacting or lack of interaction, rather. So that's my defense. Okay, ready for your vote, everyone? Does anybody want me to resend? I would. Like I mean, to I'm not. Gonna, I'm not yeah, voting. Yeah. It sounds like it's not going to go through. So I'm not let's voting. Vote. I'm not voting. Okay, let's vote. You're not rescinding? Yeah, let's let's okay, take it to voting vote. in three, two, one. Vote. One vote. <laughs> Mango, you are alive. That's okay. interesting. That's the least votes I've ever seen. It's, the it's okay. Flag. 
There's wow. no point in voting to go out first round. This is why I just see if I, I agree. understand. I mean, I, I think yeah, I know. No, I get Bob what you were doing there, Stuart Zerg. <laughs> I think I know what Bob was doing, and I think it was a good idea. Yeah. I'm just gonna and say I don't think I don't think account. Noble is mafia because he voted. I'm just saying right now I don't think he's mafia because he voted. You know what? Let's just go for the quiet guy, which is Nick. I mean, that's, that's, I I, 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 under, I completely you, but... understand if you wanted to do it to me because I'm playing a shitty town right now. I'm just still trying to get the this the game going and just understand everything. There's so been I a few shitty it. towns. And, yeah, it, Nick like, and Cameron. Are... Carlton's been pretty quiet. Rob yeah, has kidding. been shooting himself in the foot, I feel like, constantly. And I don't know if that's just being bad, bad or just being mafia. Um, the, doc, the doc over here hasn't been saying very much. But when he does, he, he contributes. It's just that he's been quiet. I think Cameron has spoken most when, when he was put pressure on more than anything else. Rob has just been super quiet. I haven't heard Tim talk in a long time. And he just looks like he is fucking dazed by the massive 60-inch <laughs> screen. I like just mesmerized by it. It's hard to get a read on, uh, like a solid read on too many people right now. I think Rob is still a decent choice for Mafia if we have to, if we have to lynch somebody as a we need to lynch somebody to get this moving more than I think he's actually completely mafia. And I'm not comfortable I, with that. I, I'm not comfortable I disagree voting with that. With the, I disagree with Rob. I, I, I'm I've been not saying that, but I'm also like suspicious of you. So like, I don't know. I also don't I think Nick is a, uh, yeah. is a good kill just because he's quiet. And so rule one, Nick, when you're town, you don't want to give up and be like, okay guys. Yeah. Lynch me. Like, yeah. Convince us your town. Uh, Just convince us your town. I mean, especially this first night, right? We had the yeah. chance to reduce and kill power. So right. as town, you should thing. understand how important this vote is, right? So, like, I just want to point to, out that that's why I'm not voting these people that I think that are town. I think Rob's town. I think Mango's town. I think Nick is town, and I I have a strong. I feel like Storzberg is town. The people that I am personally suspicious of is Noble, Cameron, and a little bit Carlton, but Carlton's reach is very small. And I'll I tell you, noble. I need. I think I've we need to hear from noble. Since the very beginning, uh, and I know that you continuously think that I'm mafia because I'm gonna be quiet. Sorzer and Mango and Ryan and um, Rob have had a lot of pressure. I'm sitting back, listening, watching everybody's reaction to what's going on. I've gotten false uh, reads off you before been... because you were quiet, like when I was cop, and I'll check you, and like it's not. And I was like, I'm pretty sure that you've got to be mafia. So you're just one of those players, unfortunately. I just uh, want to point out because it gets yeah. like a lot of games. Like I get called out for being quiet when I'm actually talking, like a considerable amount. Like I've brought up numerous things this game. It's just because I'm not interrupting people that people always think that I'm not talking. Um, right. So I mean, if anybody ever wants to hear anything, like I will give you my thoughts on it. But like I've brought up a few different things. I've talked about mango. I've talked about no. I've talked about a few different things in this game. So it's well, not no, like I've been sitting here. I wasn't. I wasn't. I wasn't being being silent. Um, um, hey, let's let's skip this. No, no, I'm not saying you were, but I'm just saying like, in general, like, I call it out a lot in games right, for being quiet right. when I'm not actually being quiet. Okay, let's skip that. And I would just want your input on the games right now. Okay. Um, right now, things that I've noticed, uh, like I've I already talked about the mango situation. I saw it differently than everybody else did. The mango okay, situation. I'll, I'll accept that. Um, Wait, what do you mean by that? Do you, do you think, I, do you I, the way that I thought it went down, I thought Mango was pressuring Noble, and that's what caused him to give his defense. And then Mango said he didn't like his defense. That's what, how I saw it go down. But evidently, everybody else saw it go down a different Did way. you agree with no, Noble's defense? Or did you agree with Mango's assessment of Noble's defense? Or did you have a different opinion on it? I, wasn't, I didn't have a solid reading on Noble before going into it. And mm -hmm. I, his, Noble's defense didn't give me a solid reading going either way out of it. Okay. Like, okay, he didn't so, convince me that he wasn't Mafia. He didn't convince me that it was town. Okay. I'm going to yeah. point I mean, are we at Hold the point? Hold on, no, no, no. You... Let, let's keep Carlton Yeah, on. keep going. Okay. Sorry. Um, so, there was the read on Tim that I also talked about earlier. Uh, that Mango thought Tim was town. Ryan immediately jumped on, said he was town. Um, we've gone back and forth on Nick a couple times. It always seems to get put off. Um, Ryan, I know, said he had, like, a bad town read on Nick. Um, what do you think about that? I think he's playing a bad town. Okay. I, mean, right. I don't think he's, I don't know if he's mafia, but I think he's not playing a good town. Okay. Um, I think that you, I can't tell if you're doing the thing where you try when you're mafia, where you try and get other people. Cause no, I, I think cause you're, Is you're this accusing myself? people. Yeah. You're accusing people more than you're trying to get other people to accuse. Which is less mafia than you normally do when you're mafia. Like a lot of times when you're mafia, you try and 
like you try and like ask people and try and like get the like, you try and get other people to make an accusation so you can kind of reinforce that and then get yourself on their good side. How have you but felt you about to, his accusations? I think he's accusing people more than trying to get accusations right now. Right, but I, I do you agree or disagree? disagree or? Here's what I think. I think uh, Storzerg, so last week, Storzerg, I think it was last week, he got lynched. No, two, games, on, two, was, two weeks ago. It was two, two weeks, weeks ago. ago. He got lynched night one of both games. And I no, think no, no, he, no, not night, day. Or day one of both games. And then, like, I think he learned a lesson from that because he played really I also, I also formal to change his game up. I formaled Mafia first round every game, just pointing that out. Do you think that was pure skill? I think I had a really good read on Neil. Down. I had a really good read on Neil, I felt, but I just couldn't convince people, and I guess I just... Focus way too hard on Neil. He ended up being Mafia and trolling you all. Uh, and the game before that, it was Cameron. That, you know, I felt he was a good lynch. Uh, and I wouldn't say it was luck or anything on that one, but it definitely wasn't, you know, hundred percent or anything like that. Not like Neil. Like I really felt I had Neil. I mean, so can, can I, I call a formal? Like five, whatever. I'd like to call a formal on Noble. I was about to say, I want to hear from Noble before I formal him, because I feel it's unfair if we formal him right now. <laughs> Why? I mean, because he hasn't anything. Off Noble I'll tell you, well, you're muted. No, I'll, I'll, tell, I'll tell you why. One, he's muted. And two, I don't think he's the kind of person to interject and talk over anyone because he is muted, right? So well, he, he mutes yes. because he has a lot of background noise. I, I understand why he mutes, that's what I'm saying. But I think, like I said earlier in the game, we should make a conscious effort to poke Noble because not poking him and then just killing him, I just feels kind of be um. Well, I mean, I'm calling a formal, so he has a chance at his defense. Yeah, and okay, I don't feel like it. you get a good enough read just by questioning him. Like, I want to hear it. I want to hear from him when his life is on the line, right? So I'm yeah, gonna I understand. I want to move while he does this. Sorry. <laughs> All right, so that's fine. I mean, I'm not gonna be explaining like a lot about the other games, but it this just always happens. I mean, you guys, you know. You just talk I about this game. Much. Forget, for, no, but, forget, all right. forget all that. So just you, talk about you're saying game. I don't talk much. Right you know, Tim is right in the sense, you know, I don't like talking over people or whatnot. And, like, my ideas when I first talk still stand. I didn't like how Mango's, like, out there, like, just accusing me right away. I compared that to, like, past time how Unctious acted. I feel Unctious is acting more, is acting town this game. Um... Nick has been as quiet or maybe even quieter as me. I'm not trying to defer the blame, but he's he's one that I would be targeting too. And at the same time, I could see why you guys are targeting me as well. Um, other than that, Rob, I'm still, I'm still really on the fence with Rob. Um, he didn't convince me in his, in his little spiel. Um, Storzerg, I feel could be safe, but I don't, no one's really pressured him. Like I would be kind of wanting to see how he responds to like a little pressure. And Ryan is just always, just always back there. So. I'm always, always back I, there. Shoulder. Always I watching. I mean, Noble's Mafia. No. I don't think so. Definitely not. Definitely I don't think not. so. I would, I would not. like to not lynch Noble. I'd rather either lynch Ribo or Rob right now. Yo, I'm I'm all what? over the two. I think those are my two my most suspicious people right now. I want to hear from Ryo said, real quick though why he changed his mind on uh, on Noble. My my reasoning be behind changing my mind on Noble. Actually, I never said that Noble wasn't um, Mafia. My initial reaction just when I talked three minutes ago was Noble was suspicious to me. Earlier so, in the game, I remember you defending him a little bit. So, I mean, since I'm the one the that called the formal the on... Yeah, I mean, we're almost an hour oh. into day one, so a lot of information gets passed around. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm still not formal. asking what... Is there a formal what? still standing? Mango yeah. had something to um, say. So, just the way that Noble was speaking, I don't know, I, don't, I didn't feel the same confidence or even, like, desperation of previous um, formals on him in day one, where... Because he, where I didn't... 
I, I didn't do that around. because every time I, I act like that and say that I'm not, I don't know how many times you said you don't want me to talk about past games. Past games, I've been accused of mafia and I've been killed. And was I mafia? No. So what do you want me to do? You want me to do the same defense and then you're going to say that I'm acting the same way and then you're just going to kill me again? What do you want me yeah, to do? So, I mean, I always... That's good. That's I, really want to interject. <laughs> I really want to interject and let me finish what Carlton asked my question before, before we vote in. My, my accusation on Noble is very simple. It, when he was asked, well, first of all, you've been quiet, right? When he was asked, he looked around the screen and it looked like he was just kind of pointing out people. My reads, I don't even need to look at the screen right now to tell you exactly who I think is. He just said Sorzer. He's like, he hasn't even been accused. Well, three people already said that he was a little bit suspicious. And he just defended himself not for 20 seconds ago. So how much are you really paying attention to the game? Which makes me suspicious of Mafia because... I think like, the only time I was accused was... Back. Hold on, hold on. You may be sitting back and it's like, okay, well, does this even really matter to me? Do I stay quiet? I'm just pointing these things out. If that makes me suspicious, then I don't know what else to do as town other than continuously read people. I wasn't, I wasn't trying to throw an accusation. I was just wondering. I was genuinely curious. Call, I'm, I'm just telling yeah. you. I mean, stores are By the just way, saying, I'm, I'm rescinding my vote on Noble, and I want to formal Rob again. It's been well, just about an hour, so. You're right. No, so, I mean, hey, we're on track. I'm not sure what yeah. new information has happened. Maybe you want me to do like a TLDR of my defense again. I mean, what are you, what are you looking for no, me now? So, Nothing much. I mean, I don't really have anything specific for you to defend. It's just we've kind of gone around the circle of almost everyone here. I agree. And I, I feel like, you know, most people that we formaled, um, I like their defenses enough. And I think yours was the weakest out of them uh, by far. And um, right. I, I can't shake the feeling that you're mafia. So. Well, like I said 45 minutes ago, I'd be more than happy to con be consistent with my philosophy and say either kill me or move on. Uh, the, one, like, the, the one point that I had, and I'm not even saying that you should even take it more than just a thought, was that that there was that play going back and forth between Ryan Ryba, uh, between Ryba was pointing out between Cameron and Ryan, and I think there was some sort of like play in the early game between uh, you and Ryan as well. I'm not even saying that's something that should be gone. I just think that since I'm more of just being read as a meh or not a great read, I think it's better to kind of do a, uh, a lynching which can open more doors rather than just close one shitty door you can kind of get more ideas of what where people are moving around but if you got to kill me and see that mafia has to kill power tomorrow i mean you do what you got to do I, mean, I said this like you know 15 plus minutes ago just to kind of get right. the game moving i'm totally so fine with you i am not rescinding yeah, that's okay. like the worst offense dude Vote i can't on rob I'm no. to make three i just don't have like two <sighs> one vote I wish you would like try no, to defend Three, four, five, five, six, seven, eight. If vote passes, Rob dies, everyone go to sleep. Oh my god. One hour day one. Thank God. Okay. Mafia, do your thing. Cop do your thing. Medic do your thing. Forgot how to mod. It's been so long since I've had to do something. Do, 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 do. 